Hello guys, welcome to my YouTube channel. In this tutorial, we'll be looking at the dangerous prop. That's what I call it. So basically, React props usually receives information or data in form of either Boolean strings or numbers. But we could also have a case where we need to pass HTML props to it. Like you could run an API and then the response could be an, an HTML body. So in this particular case, you realize I have a P tag here with some information uh, this is the opening and the closing tag and we don't want it to be displayed like this so to do so we need to write code to make it work as we need it so back inside the code this is what we are going to do we create a markup function so what this does is it tells react that we want to output html and not strings because when you pass the contents to it as a prop over here it receives it as a string and we don't want it to be displayed as a string like how we've done it down here. So what you need to do is to add the dangerously set in a HTML prop to the div that you want to display this particular contents to. And then you call this particular particular function. So over here, I'm receiving content as a prop over here and I'm destructuring it. So I get content over here, pass it over here and then after I add the dangerously set in a HTML, I just call this particular function and it does the magic for us. So now let's save and preview. Now we, we realize we have our paragraph tag displaying the content as it's supposed to be shown. So this is how to use the dangerous prop in React. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to hit the subscribe button. See you next time.